All right, so Luce, this is documentary. I'm going to document. We talked about it last week about how you need to be more aggressive out there. So I'm just going to show you this video, give you some pointers so you can see exactly what I'm talking about on some of these things, okay? That's all. Good screen. Go help rebound. Go, go to the basket. Why are you waiting? Good way to stop the ball. Good rebound. Okay. All right, let's ball. Good rebound. But when your teammates, when Nate's going to the basket like that, go ahead and follow him. You can get the offensive rebound and put it back. You just sat, you just stood there and watched. That's not aggressive. That's not playing aggressively. Rebound now. Go. Okay. Run the ball. And one. Good way to run the court with your teammates. That was good. Always be in position. I possess position. I'm telling you, you got the big body. You got to use your big body, BJ. Okay? Use your big body. Get down the court. Get an offensive rebound. You can get a nice little quick put back. Right, yeah. I don't need to show all the downtime. Okay, here we go. Defense, you're pointing them out. Let's see. He's not a threat, so you should come over. That should be your rebound. beyond. Okay. On the floor. Go inside now. Well, yep, that's good. It's all in timeout. Okay, on that play, that was good, but you have to kind of go. Just fill it in the lane, hoping to get the ball back to you. Okay, I don't have a problem with that. Timeout. All right, y'all ball. Are you taking it out? Be smart. Make a good hard chest pass. Good shot. Now you go rebound. Why are you going outside for? Why are you going out? You need to rebound. You big body, Blue Jay. Quit going outside of the basket. Go to the hoop. Get yourself a rebound. That's what I'm talking about. You're not aggressive that way. You got the biggest body out there. You have to use it. He's a non-threat when you're playing on defense. You should be in the lane more. He's a non-threat. Okay, good, good. Get involved. Okay, that's good. Yep. Now run. Rebound. Okay. Once again, New Jack, you should always be, when your teammates go to the basket, you should always be following them. Get knock somebody out the way. Well, not offensive foul wise, but knock them out the way. Get the offensive rebound and put it back. Now, in this instance, you got that guy trying to box you out. Knock him out the way and get the rebound, offensive rebound, and put it back. That's a mismatch. You need to know, you need to know this mismatches. Okay, he made it. No dismiss matches. All right, once again, your man at your guard is a non factor. You know, you should be over. That should be your rebound. Okay. Yeah. You have to be more aggressive. Good, good cut. Now stay there, rebound. Okay. He just, he was open, he just didn't pass it. That was a good, cut. That was a good cut, though. Way to cut to the basket, though. I have no problem with that. Talk about the hands. Yep, good. Okay, overall, you know, as I said, let be a little bit more aggressive. That's the end of the first first quarter there. I'm just saying, just be a little bit more aggressive, especially on offense, when your teammates go to the basket. You could get some putbacks. These guys are not bigger than you. You need to use your muscular body to get some rebounds and go back up. Easy finishes. I don't remember him at all. All right, so it's their ball. We're playing defense, so let's see who you got. Okay, you got the big fella. So he is a threat, so you have to play him a little differently. And so you gotta, you gotta put some body on him. Let him feel you, let him know that you out there. Okay. Let him know that you out there. Especially when the ball goes up, you gotta rebound. Grab it, squeeze it. Defense. Make sure you grab the ball for taking off. You got to see. Okay, you good. You good. Okay, now come out hands. Yep, good way to move. Good way to move. Good, good D. Follow him. Nice defense, D-line. Yep, go to the basket with him. Go to the basket with him. 
See? See? You got in there. You got able to get the ball. Jump ball, jar ball. See what I'm talking about? You went to the basket, and guess what? You ended up getting a tie up. You ended up getting a tie up because you went to the basket. You're a big body. You have to use it. Good way to follow Deion to the basket that time. Go to the basket. What you waiting out there for? Once again, you're looking out. Why are you looking? You could, that could have been your rebound. Go. DJ, you can't hang out at the three-point line. You're one of the biggest guys out there. You're a big guy. Get down and, and bang. That's my pet peeve. That's not aggressive. Why are you hanging out up top? Get down in the, in the, in the uh, scrum. Okay, even now. Uh, try and get... Okay, that's good. Good way to get in there. Try and grab that rebound. That was great. That's what I'm talking about. You should always be around the ball. Like around the basket. You should not be up top. You should be free throw line and down. That's where you should be hanging out at. When the ball goes up. That's where you need to be. It's just constructive criticism. Good D. Yep, good. Good way to be strong. Good way to be strong. Watch your back. Yep. Good way to look. Okay. All right. Good, good aggressive. Good way to go down the court aggressive. Good. Good chest pass. Should be down in there, Lou. You keep seeing it this whole video. Good, good D. Okay, yep, you good. Yep. Ah, monster steal. Yep, good way to be there. You're in good, great position. Great position. You can help and you can guard. Let it go. You gotta help on that. Don't let him just go right past you. That's a basket. You have to step and stop the ball, man. Don't watch him just go to the basket. Leave your man to come over and help. Jordan got a steal. You can make a move. Go to the basket now. Now, offensively, if you get the ball, you need to go ahead and try and do something with it. Go to the basket now. Go to the basket. Why are you down? Why are you at the three-point line? I keep telling you. What are you doing? What are you doing? Nate was going to the basket. You were shying away. Go to the cup. Defense is okay. You missed the guy driving. Right now. Now go. Get in the scrum. Don't just look. All right, you're going to guard Jordan now. You can help. You can help off him. You can help. Help defense because he's not a threat. They have a good way to come over. See, I'll tell you, where's the rebound in that? What's wrong with you? Are you hurt? Something's wrong with you today. What is wrong with you? It don't seem like you want to be here. Very unenthusiastic out on the court. Are you tired? Very unenthusiastic at all. Like, like we made you come. What is that all about? See the gimpy walk you have? Are your feet hurting? That's what me and your mom are talking about. What's wrong with you? You don't tell us we can't get it fixed. It's just going to get worse. 14 5. When the guy 
guard gets it like that, you have to go get it from him. They can't dribble. Okay, good way to point. Good rebound, Dion. That's a foul. Cut to the basket. Go rebound. Go rebound. Nice shot, Nate. go to the ball aggressively. You jog to the ball. That's why he didn't pass it to you. The body language is all jacked up. The problem with your, dip, your disposition is you're mad because they're not passing the ball. But you're not going to get the ball. You're not. Your body language says it all. You could have had a bunch of offensive rebounds and putbacks. They're not passing the ball. You got to go make it happen yourself. Offensive rebound and that's the way you get involved. You're standing around that three-point line. That's why you're looking down. You have to make things happen. Right, play some defense here. White ball. That could have been yours. Your follow, that could have been yours. 